uh, people of Earth. My name is Fran, and today we are in Converse about Adam Lambert. Surprise, surprise, like I talk about anything else these days. Um, yeah, there's brand new Army Lambert cover of Rocky. Rah, 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 Rolling Stone. I, let me, let me just, you know, I can't speak, obviously because of the cover because it was just so hot but <laughs> yeah I don't see past the pretty sometimes and yeah have you seen his face mm-hmm pretty uh, the cover shoot was very wild that whole they had that whole theme uh, with a green snake um, Insert jokes about trouser snake here. <laughs> um, yes, so the interview. Uh, Adam came out. Now, uh, in other news, the grass is green. <laughs> um, no, I'm sorry. I should not mock. But really, really, Adam, really? You could be more obvious if you wore a shirt with that said, I'm gay. Or had it tattooed across your forehead. Okay? <laughs> this is ridiculous. You are coming out of a closet, you are never in, okay? That's just like saying your hair is dyed black or saying that, I don't know, it's just unfathomable, really. It would be more of a shock if you said you were straight, really. If you said, I'm, I'm straight, by the way, would have been, that would have been shocking and a million fan girls across the nation would have jumped for joy, I'm sure. Um, I just think it's ridiculous that one, he, he felt the need to. You have a boyfriend. I think that's obvious enough, love. Two, that Rolling Stones gave him a cover to do so. And three, that everyone's just accepted it and not like just called him out on being a total just I love you Adam you, everyone knows how much I adore I would rush at the granny walk on probably but really love really uh, it just annoys me a little I guess that this happened that you felt the need that you you took up like pretty much half an interview you saying about how you're gay when it was plain to see but whatever if you felt like if you felt a need I guess then congratulations on dancing in front of the closet <coughs> during the interview which I haven't read because as you can tell I'm English and we don't have it over here he talks about um, other things about like Idol like Chris and Alison how they're like family again really I didn't see that watch me roll my eyes oh sorry I don't know why I'm so bitter um, and uh, there was a bit of maybe badness I, I, I sense coming from Danny Adam and I hate it so I'm going I'm not even gonna talk about it because it annoys me and upsets me so I'll move on um yes oh, and uh, in other Adam Lambert news he won a Young Holly Award Award so and he looks fierce with his new hair and uh, there were pictures of him and Cara which were adorable and Cara looks like his mum or big sister or something but it's like ah oh, this, 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 oh, this is my brother but yes it's very very cute I love it um I just feel a bit annoyed at him I don't know why that why come out Adam why we don't you don't need to we know okay we know <sighs> okay that was like uh, yeah that, I think that's it I think that's all of my Adam Lamberty style news for now. Although he's everywhere. He's absolutely everywhere. I feel sorry for Chris. He won. 
he won. But everyone's always about having that, but... I'm starting to feel sympathy for Chris. I really am. I've, I've, I've grown to like him a lot over the past week. I, I guess it's because there's so much hype about him. And I just feel so sad that Chris won. And, and where's, where's, where's everything about Chris? Where is it? Damn it. Where's Chris's front cover? Where's Chris's interviews about his family and his wife? Yeah. I don't know. But hey, uh, that's, that's just me. And that's it. Bye bye loves.